Hello, this is Tukies, and I'm doing another one of my super chilled water experiments. And the shaker ball is some super chilled water. And the measuring cup is some tap water. And on the clock is the time. I'll put in the uh, tap water into the shaker ball, see how long it takes for it all to freeze, and show you how much is actually frozen. And now we shall wait. <coughs> okay. Uh, this is Tukies again. It's been about half an hour. Now let's see how much of this water is actually frozen. Yes. Pour it out. We started with a full cup of water. So, see right there. We had one cup of water to begin with. Now we've got a bit under a quarter of a cup. And that is within the half hour that we've had. Now, water freezes from the source of the cold. So, to prove that this wasn't just put into a freezer, because there will be a layer of ice on top. And I'll show you the ice that is formed on the inside. Yeah. See that there? <coughs> that, that ring of white around the black hole that is all ice. Yeah. So three fourths of a cup frozen in about half an hour. Can't do that with a conventional freezer. Hello, this is Turkey's again with another super chilled water experiment. In the water bottle, we have 17 fluid flu fluid ounces of my super chilled water. The pitcher is one and a half quarts of room temperature tap water, and on the clock you have the time. I'll simply put the super chilled water bottle inside the pitcher and have the ice form the bottle. Right. See, so take a look at the time. And I'll take it out when it's ready. Okay, we're back and it's been approximately 25 minutes. See, uh, I've been breaking the bottle off the side because it's been freezing throughout the period, but that's the same bottle that I put in. Now, there is a thick layer of ice that is built onto the bottle. Okay. You probably can't see it too well, so I shall show you. Three, two. One. Yeah. Now, if you had just seen, this is ice that had just broken off the bottle. This proves that I did not put it in a freezer because ice forms on the source of the cold. So, that bottle is extremely cold enough to freeze. Tastes pretty good too. Mm. Mm. Here. So, that's another one of my super chilled water experiments. Pardon me while I chewed all the size. <laughs>